Hey YouTube, it's Erin and I am the Handbag Housewife and I'm back again with another video. I am standing here at, here we go. I'm gonna try not to capture anybody on this video except for me and the bags. So starting off, we kind of have some of the old reliable styles. We've got the, the Bandit in the full size, some of these Rogues and Rogue Totes. And I can't remember the name of the bucket bag, but we've talked about that before. But what just came in yesterday was this Hampton bag, which is made out of glove tanned leather. It's $295, comes in a wide variety of colors, as you can see, and it has a really cool clasp. This is from their archival line, and it looks like Gucci. Honestly, this clasp looks like Gucci, but maybe Coach did it first. You just squeeze together the sides here where it's sort of a teardrop and it opens up like so to close the bag. When you look inside the bag, you see all leather. I believe this one is in the color saddle, but 100% leather lined, a great little grab and go baguette style almost bag. And I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna clip it on. It's much easier, I promise, if I had two hands but I'm gonna clip it on and then I'll try it on for you. So the strap drop is a little short, but it actually is comfortable. And I do have a heavier kind of hoodie on today. I'm very, very casual, like normal. But as you can see, it's just a very slim, comfortable bag to wear. It would be great for going out and doing something where you didn't wanna worry about your bag. Make sure you don't go anywhere because I do have a lot to show you. Some of this stuff looks very familiar, but I will tell you that this color is not deep gray. It's a blue gray and I have something fantastic to show you in the blue gray here in a minute, but this is one of the larger Lana bags and I'm going to try it on for you too. So here is the Lana bag on me in this blue gray color and the strap here does tend to come off a little bit you can overlap the straps to sort of keep it on and it is very comfortable under the arm leaving a pretty wide area at the base that you could have your stuff in and still be comfortable in the position you're in green must be the thing for the season as you can see we've got some carries both in the crossbody style as well as the more hobo type style I think this is Amazon green because another bag I looked at over there was Amazon green. And I don't know the name of this color, but it actually comes across much prettier in person. That's a better look at what the color is without the fluorescent light hitting it directly, but it's a really fun color. It's a little bit more muted than I am seeing it here on the screen. I haven't seen this croc effect or this embossed croc Cassie 19 before. It's a cute little bag. It still has all the features of a normal Cassie 19 bag with the silver hardware, but it does have a different finish. And I do like this better than like the cat print one that came out not so long ago. My favorite Lana size would be this little one. And I did try on the chalk one at the airport. I can link that vlog down below so that you can see more eye candy, but this does go really nicely crossbody. And again, it kind of reminds me of the Louis Vuitton Atlantis, but it's designed better. And honestly, it actually feels better to the touch as well. So there's the one I actually tried on and it does look like it is ivory to me, especially when you put it up against the chalk Cassie 19, it's definitely an ivory shade, but I love both of these shades of cream by Coach. So this store has a pretty wide sale selection. These rubies down here are actually 50% off. I'm at the Oak Park Mall in Kansas City, Missouri, and I do believe they will ship to you if you call them up. So if you see something that you can't find online or you just wanna make sure you get a bag that's in good condition and they can send you pictures, you can just call this store up and order it. I imagine some of these things that they have aren't available online anymore. So it's nice to see what eye candy they have here. So the Pilla Madison was a popular style or still is a popular style. And I actually had a few of them. I don't anymore. I've kind of gotten into some different brands for my puffy bags but they are gorgeous bags and these are 50% off. You do have to be careful of the leather on the seat. You can see that this one, the floor model is a little bit scuffed on this bag. 
My friend Julie from Agent Bag Reviews has the black one and it's like one of her go-to bags. She absolutely loves this style. So the Pillow Madison is being discontinued. If you want one, this is your time. I don't know if they'll bring it back. It doesn't look like they will. So there you go. So these little Rogue 20s with the braids, they are marked down 30% from 625. So they're in the low $400 range. And then of course this one here without the braids is gonna be a little bit less. So they do have a great selection of rogues. Look at the tea roses on this one. It is, it is very, very gorgeous. One of my favorite styles by Coach is the Soft Tabby, and these are 40% off, so I think they're around 350. So we have the Brick Red, we have the Amazon Green at 350. I, this one I assume is at 352, and then the braided one, with it has actually a tooled leather strap with some color in it. That one is 385. So here is the braided Rogue 20. I think this bag is adorable. It's extremely well made. I love that it has this strap. You can adjust it to whatever point on the strap that you want it on. In addition to that, the bag's just looking slightly bulkier than it actually is because there are also two shoulder straps. So here is the Mira bag that I just bought, except for it's in black. Now here are some of those straps you can buy separately. I have this one. And then I also have the one from my tally bag with the chalk trim, which is what I'm going to use on my mirror. As I showed you in the video I did a couple days ago, I'll link it down below. I just got to see a new color I haven't seen in person, and that's this blue gray color. Love, love, love this one, but I'm gonna try not to be a collector and limit myself to one mirror, even though this color, it's almost like burnished on the edges and it is, it's quite fabulous. And this is a floor model and it is in like perfect condition. So I'm loving this color. Maybe if it goes on a deep sale, I'll buy it, but I have the chain already. So it doesn't call to me quite as much as the chalk one did. I will tell you that since Bloomingdale's is running the sale, for the $296.25, if you want a color they have here that Bloomingdale's doesn't have, they said that they would price match, which is awesome. So you could get the gray for the $296.25. So these bags are called the Harley bag and they're new. The chalk one, I think it's chalk, it could be ivory, is $4.95. It comes with a crossbody strap. This green one comes with either a shoulder strap or a crossbody strap. I'm gonna go ahead and try them on real quick for you. So again, this one's $4.95, it comes with one strap. It has a cool horse and carriage detail in the front. And then if you look inside, it is all leather lined. It has a slip pocket up here in the front and it's just a nice size bag. The smaller Harley is more almost a baguette type size, I guess you could say. This is in a beautiful green, it's 450, but again, it's not that big of a difference between this price and the price of the bigger one. It does, however, come with two straps. So the color on this one is army green. I've got it on with a really thick strap that it comes with. And I think I like the silhouette of this one a little better. It may not hold quite enough. It does have this really good button type closure. I suppose you could end up with some scratches if you didn't hit it in the right spot because it does protrude quite a bit, but it's not hard to close at all. And it does have the glove tan leather and they both also have a nice back pocket. Here is another peek at some of the idle bags, also a new bag from Coach. Something to keep in mind though is that this is not detachable like it is on the Mira. It does, however, come with a beautiful 1941, or actually, they're not saying 1941 anymore, but they look like they're 1941, hang tech. And I have to say, I'm always drawn to the more creamy colors. So something that's different now is that the tabbies are now coming in a glove tan leather in addition to the pebbled leather. And there are some new colors in the Studio Baguettes as well. If you haven't seen the black on black robe top handle, 
here is one to look at and I did check out the hardware just to see if it had chipped at all here being handled a lot as a floor model and there is just very very slight wear and tear on the d-rings but it wears pretty well considering it's a floor model so they may have found a way to improve this black on black hardware and i do know they have really good customer service after the fact if you have a problem for the first year i forgot to show you the black on black rexy i'm gonna grab it and go model it in the mirror so here is the blacked out Rexy on me. I'm gonna go ahead and take a peek inside. The zippers on these bags are extremely smooth. I'm gonna also show you the star bag and the zipper is very smooth on it. They're leather lined and look, they do have a thin crossbody strap. I can't believe how smooth the zipper is even on the star bag. I mean, it has to go up and down and around and it just glides like a dream. And here is the star bag on my frame. This and the blue gray have to be my favorite new colors by Coach. This is camel. And I mean, I'm telling you it's perfect. I need a bigger bag in camel because I am digging this shade. Of course, we've got the army green here in the tabby 26. We have a few of the heart style in the saddle color. And then I'm not really familiar with what color this magenta is. I do think if you're gonna do a patent type finish, doing one with a signature might be the way to go so you don't end up with all the fingerprints showing quite as much. It's a really pretty finish. And they've done it in the green really well, as well as this magenta hued color. Anytime you get into having just the solid, you can see the fingerprints on the top of the flap. These little sequin baguettes are just adorable and i said baguettes but these are the studio baguettes this is the little one i showed it to you at the airport in silver and i guess that one was so hot it totally sold out that was my favorite but they also have the beautiful pink one and a black one as well and then up at the top they've got some more of their shine collection as well as some patent and black on black sammies for those of you silver hardware girlies we have or i guess boys too we have some soft tabbies with silver hardware. I believe this is ivory with silver hardware. Then we also have a nice, almost like a beechwood type shade of taupe with the silver hardware as well. So that color is actually called buff, like in the nude, at least in my color nude or pretty close. So there are two new bags here. This is the hobo bag. It has a shorter strap to wear on the shoulder. This one really reminds me of the Prada re-edition, but honestly, it's probably designed better. It has almost a Saffiano type finish, but it's not as shiny and it's not as coated. It also comes in the black on black, as well as the army yeah. green. Yeah. And then these come with a guitar strap that matches and they're a full on crossbody as well as a thicker, I mean, not the thickest, but a decently thick crossbody strap and matching leather. They're lined in a, like a twill type fabric and these are $350. This is the swing bag. This is sort of a Marc Jacobs the tote bag competitor. I held it up next to the Rogue 25 and it's about the same size. It's made out of canvas. It has this cool woven Coach New York and it also does come with a crossbody canvas strap and silver hardware and these are 195 so these would be an amazing christmas gift here's another shade of the swing tote in the smaller size and then here is the bigger one and it's 250 dollars. this is about the size of a rogue 30. i would say that this is pretty comparable to the new medium mark jacobs the tote bag and this would be more like the small in their new terminology Correction, I called these the swing tote bags, but they're actually the carry-all bags. And there is the back side, side. It also and comes with the crossbody strap on the inside as well. So oh, it, it does, does have a lot of room. It has lots of pockets and it zips on the top. And that strap's actually really cool. And I assume the strap on this one would be the same. So this may be the last thing I show you today. These are some new belt bags. And again, coming in an ivory, the army green and the blacked out. They're $1.95. And 
the leather on them is really nice, especially this back part. It just feels really, really soft. And so that might be a very nice option for you. If you want a leather version of something like the Lululemon belt bag, and they do come with these nice clips for the hardware, which are a blend of plastic and what appears to be metal. Yes, metal. And they're very tonal, so you're not ending up with a bunch of wild colors. So these cute little tabby messengers are now 40% off, I believe. And they have them in this little size, but then they also have the bigger size as well. So that is another thing to keep in mind. There are so many great items on sale. I'm gonna go ahead and sign out. I'm Erin, I'm the Handbag Housewife. If you like this video, please make sure to give me a big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, what are you waiting for? Do it and ring the notification bell so that you are notified of future exciting content such as this. Also, go find me on Instagram. The name there is the same. It's the at symbol, then the handbag housewife, all lowercase. You can DM me there or you can email me at the handbag housewife at gmail.com. If I don't hear from you, I will see you real soon. Take care. Have a fabulous day. Bye.